In everyday life, we often need to add the page numbers to the document. Page numbers help identify the order and the total number of pages. Click the Insert tab and click the Page Number to select a built-in style and add the page numbers to each page of the document. If you want to set your favorite page number format, you can click Insert Page Number to pop up a dialog box. We can set the page number format and position on the page. At Page Numbering, we can make the page start at a different page number, generally keeping the default value of 1. Finally, apply to the entire document and click OK to insert the page numbers. There's also a quicker way to set the page numbers. Double click the header or footer area, where we can also click Page Number Format and customize the page number format and position. However, there are certain rules to follow when we add page numbers to the graduation thesis. For example, the cover page does not need to show the page number. The page number of the table of contents requires the style of Roman numerals, and the body part requires the style of Arabic numerals. Take this paper as an example. Double click the footer of the table of contents page to enter the toolbar for the page number editing. According to the above requirements, we click the Insert Page Number drop down button and select the Roman numeral style. Apply to the current section to add the page numbers to only this page. Then go to the first page of the body. Under Page Number Format, select the Arabic numeral style and choose From Current Page at Apply To to add the page numbers for all body pages. Now we need to separate the body text into multiple sections. Locate the position to be segmented, click the Insert tab, click the Break drop-down button, and choose Next Page Section Break. By doing so, we can insert Next Page Section Breaks to each section. Then, we find that the pages are numbered from 1 again under each section. To make all the page numbers continuous, we can locate the first page, activate the Insert Page Number dialog, and change page numbering to continue from previous section. Then choose From Current Page at Apply To and click OK to get the expected result. Now, have you learned how to insert the page numbers?